Hey guys, Tim here. Today we're going to take a look at this Cooler Master CM Storm Sirius S. S, -S, 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 -S oh, no, never mind. No Phil Collins jokes here. True 5.1 audio headset. Uh, I had a chance to wear these at PAX Prime and test them out. They sound really good. Um, they're not audio file headphones by any means, but they sound good and they have mesh headsets and they're really comfortable. So here comes the unboxing. So, 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 so serious, serious. So, oh, sorry, I did say no Phil Collins jokes. CM Storm, serious S. We're gonna get right down to business here, guys. Unidirectional microphone, four speakers for each side, uh, inline remote, which is actually one of the reasons I bought this one, other than that it's really comfortable on my big old noggin. Uh, with inline volume control and mic mute switch, I do use this headset for uh, teleconferencing as well. So, uh, inline mute switches are a must for me. Leather pouch with extra headphones, or extra ear cups, excuse me. On the back here, we have True 5.1, and look at that, it's all the exact same things that were on the side. Built for gaming enthusiasts and audiophiles. Woo! Um, <clears throat> so, I'm not going to be uh, too hard on them, but no offense, if it's not a $500 headset, they're probably not true audiophile headsets. That said, let's bust this guy open and take a look. So like any good tech, uh, opening things with, back to my opening with keys, which means I'm probably going to wind up doing it off camera completely. So I'm trying a little bit new format this time. It's a little bit on a skew, so tell me what you guys think. I'm trying to get my big paws out of the way a little more than normal so that you guys get a better view of the products and a better view of the unboxings. I am a little zoomed in. This is a little a bigger box than I'm used to for just normal unboxings, but so all cardboard box. A little plastic there. Uh, nice thing to see that these actually are made, this box is made in such a way that you don't have to completely destroy it to get the headphones out. Uh, most places don't take returns on headphones, guys, so be careful about that. Uh, I actually got these at PAX for a pretty darn good deal. Um, and that's one thing I will tell you guys, if, if you guys are looking for peripherals, especially like gaming peripherals, go to PAX, if you have one in your area, go to Comic Cons, anywhere there might be um, hardware manufacturers. So this is over a hundred dollar headset and I got it for like 40 bucks. Um, and everybody was getting them for that price at PAX. I think it was 49.99, so I guess really 50, but. Plus you have a chance to try them there. Which is actually why after, you know, there was Turtle Beach was there and, you know, Corsair, um, Steel Series. Why did I pick these? Two reasons. One is I felt like they were more sturdy. Sturdier, I guess, would be the appropriate way to say that in English, which I pretend I speak sometimes. So they feel sturdier. They come with um, extra ear cups. So if you like pleather or leather or whatever this is, you can put those on. Uh, typically, I have a hot head, though. Not figuratively, but literally. So we have our quick user guide. And a, actually a nice uh, carrying sack for them. It's microfiber, it feels like. It's actually... It's soft. But it's actually nice. So, so down to the meat and potatoes here. So we have an... An auto on off, so I don't know if you guys can hear it, but there's a light tick there. So when you put it back, it auto cancels. We have detachable uh, ear cups, so you have to take this ring off and put it on the other ones. But here's your four uh, drivers in each headset. So they are smaller than you know some most audio files. First of all, most audio files will tell you 5.1 or 7.1 uh, headsets aren't 
audiophile headsets to begin with. Um, you know, I, I tend to be really snooty about my stereo headsets, especially for uh, recording. And I would never use a 5.1 headset for that. So that's just my opinion. So we have the mic on, mic off. You have rear volume, front volume, sub volume, and center volume. And that's pretty cool. And of course, you also have a USB or analog. Also a nice touch. Um, the sleeving on the cable is absolutely gorgeous. You cannot see, and, and if you look, they're actually sleeved. Let me see if I can get a good shot of that. They're sleeved all the way up underneath uh, the plug. So, shouldn't fray. Looks really good. I mean, most companies don't do a very good job on the, the cable itself, but, you know, this is Cooler Master. And I actually really like... So, it is, it's like a rubberized plastic... And it, it actually feels really nice. I mean, it's nice and smooth. You know, there's, I like a firmer headband. So these are a little firmer, but it is gonna, you know, it is memory foam. So it's, it's gonna go to whoever's head's on it. But the main reason I bought these is the ear cups actually have two ways they adjust. So they adjust kind of like front to back like that, or they pivot in and out a little bit. And this is the movement I need for my head. So the fact that they pivot in just that little bit takes the stress off of this joint right here. And that's where I break every set of headphones I have. So eventually I'm gonna be like, you know, wrenching them out to get them on my head and I'm gonna snap them after enough times right there. So these do have a good amount of flex in the band itself and a good amount of adjustment on the headset. And like I said, I did try these at PAX already. Um, I really liked what they sounded like. I really like how they feel uh, on your head. The, the, the microfiber ear cups are awesome for dissipating heat. If you're like me and you have a head that gets hot, you know, I can wear a headset for an hour or two. But once you get past that, and especially, you know, if you're doing work, I like to listen to music. I'm sitting there doing work for my real job, listening to music. I don't want to have to, like, take my headset off because my head's hot, you know? It's like I want to keep listening to music, keep working. I don't want to have to like pull them down around my neck all the time because then everybody else I'm sitting there can hear them. So great headset. I highly recommend them. I'll put the link down in the description. Let me know what you guys think about this new format. I'm trying to do, you know, kind of a little off to the side and a little intro. I figured this headset video would be a good place to try that. Please subscribe. And this is Tim for Timmy Tech TV. We'll see you next time.